everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Fibri and today's video I am here on Bloxburg because I actually want to redecorate Buddy's room. So as you guys can see, if I go to the right of me, I've replaced like some of the new like items that they recently made. So like the new like astronaut bedroom. I placed all of this down because originally I was going to make Buddy's room into like the astronaut kind of room and like a space room like I did before. However, when I looked into my house, so this is like Buddy's room right now. So it does actually need a bit of a revamp. He's actually too big to be in this now. So he does need a big boy bed. So astronaut bed seemed perfect. But when I was looking in Poppy's room, I was like, hmm, Poppy's not going to want a princess bed. Like she's happy with how her bedroom looks. She's becoming a bit more of a teenager now. So she doesn't really want anything that's like too kid like. And then I thought, wait, where's Lily? And I was like, oh my gosh, yeah, Lily is still in my room. So Lily's still in my bedroom. And I kind of felt bad because Lily, Lily deserves like a little princess bed. So I came up with the idea that I'm going to have Buddy's bedroom into Buddy and Lily's bedroom. So they're going to share a bedroom because they are on the same age. They're still both my babies. So I think it'll be good to actually make this room into a joint princess and prince room rather than a space room because Buddy's already had a space room. As you guys know, in one of my previous houses, I decorated his bedroom to be space. So I feel like mm, space room is just, you know, he's had that before. However, on this side is where we are going to have like the prince and princess area. I think it looks so cool. So going into build mode, this is what I have originally thought. I've just placed some items down that I think go with the theme of like prince and princess, such as like, you know, a little shield and just other stuff that they have like the new items. Oh, I also thought this would be super cool to go over prince and princess theme, like the new Christmas, um, the nutcrackers, because they could be like the guards. I think will be really really cool so i just play some items down to make sure i don't forget and then when i was going to make like buddy and lily's bed i kind of like thought like i could have this for like buddy's bed so you know the little castle that goes up there and then for lily i can just go ahead and like place this in the middle and it actually fits perfectly for like lily's asleep right in here so i think that would be good another idea i had was to like make you know a custom kind of one so i put all of the furniture like a desk and then i put these tables all around like her crib because i thought that'd be a cool little castle one but i think i like this idea more so i think we're gonna do that but yes yeah, so i think i no longer need the space area because i'm gonna go for the prince and princess theme because I think it's just a cute little theme anyway. So no space this year, maybe another year, maybe when he gets older and he wants a space theme again. But I think he's going to really like the idea of having like a prince and princess theme because, you know, he can dress as a prince and he can have the sword. And then Lily's like the little princess. I think it just goes perfectly. And then I probably will add some little things to Poppy's room. But like I said, she's kind of happy with how her room looks. She doesn't want it to be changed. It's more like a teenager room. And I think she likes that the most. But I might add some new stuff that they have. Like, for example, I might get her a little diary to put here. And then maybe like a little jewelry box to put on here too. I think she'll like that. But yeah, I'm going to like not touch Poppy's room as much because she likes how it looks. And just mainly focus on Buddy and Lily's new room. So yeah, I'm really excited to see how this is going to turn out. I've also prepared lots of decals, so I actually can have them like at the back over here. I can show you guys. So I'm going to have this on like the back wall and I've had like two decals already like made. Yeah, so as you guys can see on my account, Phoebe's decals is where I've like uploaded some decals that I'm going to use. I have little castle ones. I have rainbows. I have little cute just like fairy tale princess themed stuff, which I think will be really, really cute. And then these are like two parts that I've made. So I will just show you guys right now. So for the first decal, this is the code right here. And then I'm going to add that in. As you guys can see, it's just like part one of like a little castle fairy tale theme. And then this is the second code for the other part. And yeah, look, it just fits together perfectly. I made this on Photoshop. I just like halved it, but I think that would look really cute as like the background of like the bedroom. So I have some more that I might just place around, but I think that looks so cute. But yeah, I think we are now ready to go ahead and start decorating their bedroom. At the end, I will go ahead and get their reaction because I think they're going to love it. I mean, Buddy might not like it at first. He's going to be, you know, sharing his bedroom. But there needs to be space for Lily, at least until we find the most perfect house for us to move to. But 
that will be a while. So yeah, let's go ahead and start decorating their new bedroom. Okay, so everyone, I finally just finished decorating Buddy and Lily's room. And you guys can see a little glimpse of it right here. It's so colorful. I actually love it. The only thing I realized is that their room is so small. So when we get a bigger house in the future, I need it to be a bigger room because I had so many ideas of like decals to add and I just had no space. So it might look a little bit crowded, but I promise I think they're gonna love it. So let's go ahead and go inside my house and show you guys what it looks like. I'm hoping they like it. So let's go in here and look. I mean, like I said, it's very crowded, but I think it looks so cute. Like this would be my dream bedroom. Look how cool this looks. Let me go ahead and go in shift P so you guys can see it. So this is the room as you guys can see as you're going through the door. You are just hit with color, which I love. As you guys know, I do like colorful things. I love like little, you know, pinches of color. I love the rainbow. So I think this is perfect. And also I've actually learned how to do decals and like put it as it's like a rug instead or a carpet. And I finally learned how to do it. I will show you guys in a second because I didn't recall that part in the build because I thought I was done. And then I decided to add some decals, which I think really adds to it. But 
I love how it looks. It's so colorful. We have a lot going on in here. We have the Christmas nutcrackers, which are protecting Buddy, the big ones. And then the small ones will be protecting Lily in her little crib. We have these decal fake little fairy tale trees. I made this by like adding like a transparent like block, making it smaller, putting the painting on there and then just using the transform tool to try to like, you know, place it perfectly in there. We've got cotton candy, we've got popcorn machine, and then towards the wall, we have like their toys over here. We also have a little desk where they can, you know, read their little fairy tale book and, you know, maybe do their homework or just things like that. And then above, I've also like placed like a blue sky, which I thought looks really cool. And I've also added the new like moonlight because I thought that would go with like the sky theme too. But yeah, this is what their bedroom looks like. The new update is so cool. I do wish that this room was bigger because there was just not enough space for what I wanted. But I think it looks cute. I mean, to be fair, it's just for Buddy and Lily. And they're both kind of tiny little humans. So I reckon they'll fit in here perfectly. But yeah, I'm really happy with how it looks. I think decals makes a big difference because the trees make it look so much more like a fairy tale. But yeah, I think this looks so cute. Let me just show you guys how I um, did those decals then. So let me go in build mode very, very quickly and just show you guys. Because obviously I didn't put it into um, the build. So let me just show you. I went and got a cube and I got a transparent cube. I mean, you guys probably already know how to do this. But I just learned it today by myself. And I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so proud of myself. So I'm going to go ahead and transform my cube and just make it small. So... Let's go ahead and make it tiny. It's like that. Perfect. And I'm going to go ahead and transform it up. So just use the arrow and pick it up. And then once I have done that, I'm going to go ahead and get myself a painting. So I went ahead and used the plain huge painting. And like you can just put that on there. Then you can like transform it, make this bigger if you want like a bigger rug. And then if I exit build mode and just go ahead and change it, I can change the picture to anything that I was using before. So, um, which one should I use? Let's go ahead and change it to this one here. So, like, as you guys can see, I've changed it to this. And if I go back in build mode and then, like, transform it, I can click on the cube and, look, I can rotate it. I just realized this is what all the builders and blocks work have been doing this whole time. And I just realized. But look how cool. So, I can rotate it and I can lower it down. And look. I have my own rug. I mean, how cool is that? Look, how cool. And you can go ahead and change the picture. I mean, I could do my own like custom house everywhere now. Like even in the front room, I could change the rug and have a way cooler one, which I'm actually going to do because that'll be so cool. But yeah, I'm really happy that I realized how to do that now. Anyway, let me go ahead and delete that. So there we go. Delete. All done. Anyways, I'm now going to go ahead and get Buddy and Lily and show them their room. Hopefully they love it. So let's go ahead and pick them up from daycare. Okay, so here I am with Lily and Buddy. And Buddy, I must say, it's kind of hard carrying you when I'm also carrying Lily, but I'm trying my best. Okay, anyway, let's go ahead and show them their new room. Okay, so let's go inside. We'll shut the door because it is really, really cold. So let's go upstairs. They have no idea what is going on. Okay, actually, wait, I need to shut the door. Don't look, don't look. Close your eyes, close your eyes. Okay, you guys ready? You ready, buddy? Yeah. Okay. Three, two, one. Ah. Oh, look at this. Wow, look. It's a fairy tale bedroom. Oh, yeah, and also, buddy, you're going to be sharing with Lily. <coughs> Hey, hey, don't cry, okay? It's like, it's gonna be fine, okay? It's gonna be good. You guys are gonna be besties. Just look at the room. Look at the beautiful room. Surprise! Yeah, look, go, go check it out. Yeah, look, look about. What do you think? You like it? <laughs> I think he likes it. I think you like it. Look, your bed's gonna be up here, buddy. Look, you have a big boy bed now. Look! Oh, look, he's resting in there. See, buddy, look, you got a big bed. It's gonna be so cozy. And Lily, this is going to be your bed in here. It's going to be so cute. And buddy, look, do you see that you can slide down? I mean, it's probably not very good because you're going to slide straight into this chair. Um, But it looks really, really fun. Give it a go. Give it a go. Okay, he's going. He's going. Woo! Oh, you're stuck. Oh, never mind. Well, I mean, at least the guard saved you. Okay, there we go. Yeah, look how cool that was. But yeah, this is your new bedroom, guys. I think it looks so cute. If I shut the door, I mean, look how cozy it is in here. I kind of want this to be my room. I 
I mean, I'm jealous of you, buddy. And Lily. You guys have the best room ever. Look at this. I feel like when Poppy comes home from school, she might change her mind. And maybe she wants a kid bedroom. But like I said, she's becoming a teenager. She loves her own room. She loves her makeup now. So, hmm. Maybe she won't. But yeah, that is it. This is Buddy and Lily's new room. I think it is so cute. I kind of want to sleep in here myself. But I don't think Buddy and Lily would like another roommate. But yeah, hopefully you guys like this video of me showing you guys decorating or redecorating Buddy and Lily's new room. I hope they're really happy with it. I think they are anyway. But yeah, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet already. Like to for more content and I'll see you guys next time.